Today is the day. Uh, for those who haven't seen this video, a little bit of background, tore my ACL playing basketball in September. We're now the 13th of April and I'm finally having my knee surgery. It's 10 o'clock, admission's at 12, so I need to get showered and get my bag packed and whatnot because I might be staying overnight, not sure yet. Uh, I'm going to try and record as much as possible. I'm not quite sure how much I'll be allowed to record, but I'm going to try and document the journey as we go and then looking forward into rehab. So, I hope you enjoy and I'll see you probably in the car. <laughs> Nearly there. How's the drive been? That's awful. <laughs> I hate driving. <laughs> yeah, you are driving around a lot. Yeah, it's here, here, here. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We're safe, we made it. We, yeah, we've made it. Oh, dear me. Uh, and I think, Straight. yeah. You don't need to buzz anything. I think. You have to put, oh, everyone's reversing. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> outpatients, yeah, so that's the outpatients there. Cool. Well, thank you for driving me to the hospital. Huh? Yeah, we drive me a lot. You might have to move over a little bit before them. They're old. Okay. Pop there. Pop the kit. Cool. All right, time to time to head in. We are admitted. Lizzie's got a cup of tea. This is the first time I've ever gone private healthcare. Oh, shut the toilet. And it's basically a, a hotel room. Bloody, bloody ridiculous. We've been here now for about two and a half hours. Um, I'm next for surgery, so that's cool. Um, hopefully, we'll go in about three o'clock? Yeah, I think so. Maybe. So another 40 minutes or so. Um, I've been... I'm sure what to flash. I've been <laughs> drawn on. So that's fun. Um, yeah, they're also doing one thing that I didn't realise they were doing until the surgeon described was they're putting an artificial, I'm try to flash, an artificial uh, band across the lateral side of my knee um, because the hamstring graft that they're doing for the ACL reconstruction um, can be a bit, it's a bit weak and stretch a bit mm. too much. Um, they're going to put an artificial band in, so for the first three to four months it was to provide extra support and hopefully allow that hamstring to you know, bind and, and work properly. Um, yeah. The whole goal with this, recording it, is so that other, if other people you know, hurt their ACL or, or have other injuries, um, you can kind of, I don't know, feel a bit more relaxed about it. I think I'm quite a relaxed person when it comes to surgical procedures. Obviously working in a hospital and spending a lot of time in a hospital throughout my life. Um, today is a pretty positive day actually to get this all sorted. Um, and there'll be times obviously in rehab um, through the rehabilitation process that you know, I'll feel a bit down, feel a bit bored, you know, really want to be able to get back to the level of fitness that I was, say two years ago, um, because at the moment how I am currently, um, and I'll show in some footage now.
Oh, easy, bitch. Easy. Hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> That's staying in. <laughs> oh, I don't. Uh, as you can see from there, I'm at a pretty solid strength, you know, situation now. I'm quite stable. I think I'm quite stable um, in my knee. Um, so it feels a bit strange to have surgery when I feel quite good, but obviously I'm not playing basketball. I haven't ran for months, so I'm looking forward to getting back into all of that. Um, but yeah, try and keep. Sorry, <laughs> yeah, just waiting for um, for theatres to call. Hopefully, in about an hour's time. Um, and then everything will be going ahead. Hmm. Excited. She said half an hour. No, she said, she said that he went half an hour ago. No, that can't be right. Yeah, that's what she said. Oh, it's currently half eight. Is he still here? Um, I went down at half three. Mm-hmm. And it was a three-hour procedure. Um, some complications that they didn't foresee. Um, so ACLs, all good. Um, hamstring graft for that is good. Um, medial meniscus uh, repaired, all good. My lateral meniscus had slipped out of place. So the surgeon said that he had to drill um, I'm assuming into Bone. tibia or, yeah. or femur, one of them. I'm tibia, I think. Um, and then kind of thread through something so to pull the meniscus back in. So that's now um, that's holding my meniscus in place before I guess it, it just settles, and and then it can stay there on its own. So I'm non-weight bearing for six weeks. Um, Bit more complicated than previously thought. This is currently how my leg's looking. I'm in a brace for, I said a few weeks. Mm. I don't know if I'm going to be in a brace as long as I'm non weight bearing, but yeah, a few weeks in a brace. And uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how quickly I recover. Um, the next. <coughs> Hopefully. Hopefully still going to be discharged tonight, so, you know, fingers crossed. Um, well, you've been giving your medication. Giving my discharge. discharge. Yeah, discharge medication and discharge letter has been done, so I think I just need to see physio. Mm -hmm. Get me up, get me going to the toilet, and then I'll be back at the flat. Um, so hopefully I will see you back at the flat. And we are back. Um... Oh man, it's been a long day. It's currently 11 o'clock. Um, no, Jesus, it's midnight. <laughs> um, hell of a day. I was in and out quicker than a typical nursing shift, which to me is, is ridiculous. Um, but yeah, Lizzie has been unbelievable. Um, she's just gone to cook some food. Fucking love her. Um, so that is day of surgery complete. I was in and out in ten and a half hours. Um, let's see how uh, how this initial recovery goes. Whew. Right, we're on day, uh, well I guess day one of post-op. Um, currently half twelve. Slept quite well last night to be honest. Um, yeah, it, it actually rest, you know, I, I woke up I think I was up quite a bit, kind of intermittent sleeping. Um, I woke up at half six to go to the toilet. That was a pain. If you 
if you're watching this after going through or you know in preparing for your surgery um, the hamstring graft sitting on a toilet seat is quite uncomfortable I had to very much lean onto my uh, <laughs> unoperated uh, leg um, but that's okay that's all good um, did the exercises this morning have to do those about three to four times a day so that was um, ankle uh, flexion and extension kind of moving that um, dorsiflexion and plantar flexion um, rather um, and then quad extensions so kind of activating the quadricep muscles uh, as best you can and and then knee bends as best you can um, pretty painful not gonna lie uh, but it's the first time I've done them so I think it's you know it's gonna be painful for a few days and then when you know any swelling comes down, um, as things start to heal, it will become obviously less painful. But it's good to get the muscles activated now. Um, it's one of the key, one of the key things I was told to do within the first kind of five days post-op is to get that quad activating. Um, currently sat at my desk, um, got my leg up uh, in the brace on my washing basket, uh, so yeah, quite comfortable. Um, I don't know if there's anything else to say really. Um, I've taken ibuprofen and cocodamol today. Um, ibuprofen because the side effects are kind of less. If you've eaten, the side effects are kind of less than cocodamol and oromorph, which I've also been given. Um, I don't really want to get constipated. Uh, so if the pain is, and they're both PRN, so they're both um, when required. So if I'm not in pain, I'm going to try and avoid kind of those painkillers um, but I'll keep on top of ibuprofen um, but I did take cocodamol before the exercises just so that I could actually kind of push through with the exercises um, yeah I think that's it really um, not really doing much today just resting um, I might try and record some of my exercises later um, kind of give you a perspective on the extent of kind of range of motion that I'm managing on day one um, because it's pretty rough, but yeah, I mean, it can only get better, right? So I'll uh, I'll see you this evening when I have to do my exercises for the for the final time. I think that's when I'll record. But yeah, so I'll I'll catch you this evening. Right, I'm going to try and demonstrate oh, the exercises. Um, I might need you to get my foot up. <laughs> okay. Ready. Do you want me to take your shoe off? Um, oh yes, please. Okay, ready? Cool. And up. Oh, get this crook off, please, sorry. There you go. Ah. Cool. Okay, so the exercise that I have to do, I have to try and extend my knee so to, um, so the exercises that I have to do, I have to try and activate my quad. So I have to essentially, if you let me good leg, I have to try and do that. Hold it for five seconds, ten times, and then I have to try and bend my knee uh, as far as I can at the moment, ten times. Um, the kind of foot thrusters that I do, so this I've been doing that all day, so I'm not going to consider that an exercise that I've been doing that I can fully. You know, I can fully plantar flex, and dorsiflexion isn't too bad either. So, <sighs> right. good. yes, if you could just make sure that I'm kind of this more here. I know. Is this tight enough? Yes, I think so. Cool. All right then. Hand in your hand. Oh no, it's okay. Might Hold have on. to do that. Cute. We'll see. That. Well, see, now I can't feel it because it's in the wrong place. <sighs> it's, it's under here. Mm. I think I it's supposed to be there. my finger there. Okay. Because here it doesn't tense. Okay, that's fine. <sighs> yeah, it's good.
This must is definitely going though. It's good. I, I, I can feel that one. Is that four? Four. I think. Nice. Nice. I can see your um, knee go. That was good. I think that's six. I think that's six. I'm not sure. I've never I think that's six. Just look one, back, and it's definitely not two, six. Three. It's nice. That was nice, that was really nice. One, two, three, four, five. You can, um, okay. your knees moving now. As in, I'm getting a bit of like, like this, you yeah. know, you know how it, yeah. when you see this one, yeah, yeah, tense it. You see how that moves, yeah. This is your knee is now moving. Okay. You can see the bandage move. I'm getting a bit of um, like hyperextension. It's a, a tiny bit. Maybe. It seems like this is mm -hmm. moving as if it's been tensed. Okay, cool. That was your last okay. one. That was it. That was ten. Huh. That was ten. Right. Yeah, this was starting to move. Okay, cool. Oh, right. Now the hard bit. Yeah. That's not too bad. It's painful, but it's not too bad. Now, bending my leg is hell right it it doesn't look like i'm doing much i'm really trying when i did it earlier and i had trousers on you kind of you didn't really see it move at all but so I've, i'm in shorts now so hopefully you'll see a little bit <sighs> right and much like before like it's, it won't the first few times won't move much You know what though? What? It's the first time I've actually seen the buckle move. Buckle? Like the... Oh, the actual brakes. Yeah, yeah. Thirty-seven. Nice. How's that? That's really good. Jesus. That's about thirty. Maybe just over thirty. Okay. Is that three? That's three. Nice, 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 nice. What's the highest you've been? What was that? Don't know, but it was, it was high. It's good though. Hurts. <laughs> well, yeah. That's six, I think. Is that six? That's I think it's six. I'm not sure. Five or six. I think that was five. Okay, that's five. I don't know. No, five. Six. Mm. Grab your hand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Ah. <sighs> 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 
You're getting worse. I'm getting worse? Yeah, as stop. In, as in I'm not getting any higher? No, you're just getting like straighter Shit. and lifting it higher. I'll do two more. Do one more. Do one more, okay. Do one more, but try and actually bend. Like that, that is perfect. I actually don't think it's that bad for day one, to be fair. I was told not to do any exercises yesterday, so this is the third time I've done any movement. Um, so, yeah, maybe we'll do an update tomorrow evening just to see if I'm doing any progress, but that was the uh, end of day one. Oh, good afternoon. Uh, oh, what I uh, <laughs> welcome to day... Day four, post up. Um, we're on the Monday. I've had the, I've had the bandage taken off and everything redressed, so it looks a bit gnarly. Uh, I'll show you a little bit. So I've currently got it on my washing basket because I'm sat at my desk. So you can see they've outlined my patella here, and then these are all the bandages. I think. Did we count there's six wounds? Yeah, I think so. So six wounds. Um, there's more kind of under the here as well. Um, yes. So there's six wounds. And... Oh! So there's six wounds. Um, everything looks good. The exercises have been going well. And uh, everything looks all good. The idea of this series was to kind of document my rehab and everything moving forwards that has been affected by the complications of the surgery um, because I won't be rehabbing now for another five weeks really um, as soon as the brace comes off that's when rehab starts and the brace is on for another five weeks so I'm undecided as to whether I'll probably just record and give updates on any appointments I have so I've got physio next week I can do a little episode on that on what the physio says and show kind of physio exercises but oh, but the real juicy parts of this series will start when the brace comes off and I can actually start kind of weight bearing start doing more gym work I'm gonna have quite a bit of atrophy on this left leg now so again there's gonna be specific gym work that I'll have to do that you may not have to do if you have this kind of surgery um, but yeah hope you've enjoyed any questions drop it in the comments I'll be more than happy to answer any questions you have um, I try and reply to everyone who comments on my videos but if any of you have a similar surgical procedure coming up um, either ACL reconstruction or kind of meniscal repair or your meniscus decides to completely slip out of place um, Hopefully you're a little bit at ease with this kind of video. Um, it's not that bad. Yeah, it's a bit awkward, a bit painful. Um, with the right support, it's actually quite easy. Um, oh shit, Lizzie, look up. She's been fucking awesome. Cool. Thank you for watching. <laughs>